Good afternoon, everybody. I decided since I got a couple chips to program, I will uh, play with OBS here. Uh, there's no hurry on these chips, so I can mess around. Um, so we're going to be programming a couple hundred pin Xilinx CPLDs. These are an X2C256. I'll pull up the DigiKey data on these chips real quick here for you. There we go. Um, they are an XC2C256-7VQG100C. These cost about $50 a piece. So today, we're going to be using the Zeltec Super Pro 6100N with a 100 pin quad flat pack adapter. So first thing we're going to need to do is launch the Super Pro 6100N software. It's going to come up unmatched adapter. That's fine because we will select a device. We will go Xilinx and choose the TQFP100 package. And this is a DX3021 adapter right here. This adapter. So I will leave that off because I gotta put a chip in it. And I have to have steady hands to do that because it's a very fine pin pitch. So off camera here, I will drop this chip in. There we go. First chip is in. Lock that down. Hard to do this over the camera. <clears throat> Need to get a better camera. Okay, pull the software back up here. We are going to blank check. And we blank check just for sanity, we're going to erase. I'm going to blank check again. Okay, this chip needs to. We need to go browse U18. Okay, we've got proper checksum. Buffer, we have some data in the buffer there. We will program. We will verify. We are we don't need to set security because the customer don't want security set. So we'll take this out. Put that chip there. We'll grab this chip here. This don't take too long. Um, I wasn't working around a camera. It would go a lot faster here. So that chip is installed pin one pin one lock it down this is a u24 so we will put in a u24 we got the proper checksum we will erase blank check just common and then we will uh, program verify now if I hit blank check it will fail okay now if I erase it and then hit a blank check she does good so let's reprogram that We will verify it. And job is done. Both those chips are programmed. So, <clears throat> yes, I'm not sure if anybody wants to see chip programming. It's kind of boring. Um, 
but that is uh, how it's done.